just uh, a hellacious day today, and of course, then one yet uh, two days ago as well. Yeah. Um, what was going through your mind today? A, a 124 kilometer stage, but man, the heat, a little bit of the wind was against you the whole way. Yeah, we don't get that in Ireland, like so. It's just thought I may as well give it a go, and you never know because the, the wind can change, and you've got if you've got a tailwind, it's hard for them to catch you. So you never know on a day like today. So. Um, I, I, I mean, did you feel rested uh, from the previous day uh, going into it? Obviously, you, you felt like you had a good enough form to, to, to jump out there on an attack. But uh, talk to me about how your body has been holding up in this nine, you know, 13 stage, two week race. Yeah, I've actually started to come around a bit. I really struggled with the altitude at the start, and um, now I've kind of we've gone come down, down a bit lower and I've started to adapt better. We had a really nice, relaxing day yesterday, and it kind of helped get legs turning over, and which felt quite good at the start today but it was kind of obvious that nothing was going to go it's the same same story every day like it takes 40k or so, so to go and something just rolls off the front and then they don't let ma many go up the road it's about two or three normally i think the biggest break here is before like so uh, so uh, obviously uh, a long transfer today back to the hotel then reload do it again tomorrow of course the last three stages are are, are circuit races with a lot of laps was this kind of the, 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 the you know do you have an opportunity to break away again or do you think this was the the last gas uh, you never know we'll give it a try but uh say it's a very good sprinter so probably i'll go all in for him those last three days but if there's an opportunity i'll definitely take it and go, go from there like. fantastic thank you